Here we are. Hi, guys. Good evening. How are you? No, but it's answering. <laughs> Fine. All right, good. Everything good? Yes. Did you go to work today, everyone? Who is working from home? Raise your hand if you're working from home. Nobody? Really? So you're going to work outside? I am not working. <laughs> okay, that's a different scenario. Carla, you're working from home. Okay, that's good. What do you do? Lawyer. Oh, you're a lawyer. Wow, okay, good. What else? All right. I don't see Kenya. Michelle, I don't see you. Clara. Michelle and Kenya then. Okay. So, um, let me see. We're going to start by practicing some. All right. I'm going to send them to WhatsApp. Is everybody on WhatsApp tonight? Everybody's in the group, right? Yeah. <coughs> Do you have access to the platform? Yeah. Okay, I would take that as a yes, guys. But if you have problems with the platform or something, we need to do that. We need to take care of that right away. Okay, because it's very important. Anyway, I'm going to send you, let me see. Listen to some questions. We're going to try to break the ice by discussing some questions. We're going to talk about family, all right? So we'll listen to those questions. One second. Here it is. All right, so I sent those questions here through WhatsApp, right, about family. We haven't discussed those. We're gonna be working in small groups of four. That's to practice your speaking, all right? Also to break the ice, to get to know one another. I would like you to ask other people, if you don't know them, ask them where they work, okay, why they're studying English, and that's it first, right? And then you start with the questions. I need everybody to participate equally. All right, let's work on our speaking skills. So let's do that. I'm gonna send you an invitation in small groups of four. There it is. Accept it, please. Click on accept. Let's join it, accept everyone. Accept the invitation. Rechart. Uh -huh. Tap on accept. Very good. Hola. Hello. Hola. No Spanish. Hi. Se nos va a olvidar. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, do you know one another? Yeah. To Kenya, yes, but Juan, no. Okay, Juan, tell yeah. us, where do you work? Me. Me too. I don't know who is Juanjo. You don't know Juanjo. All right. Oh, my work. Yeah, where do you work? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I work, uh, I am a farmer. Okay. Uh -huh. I work every day, uh, all day of the week. Every day uh, of the week. Only Sunday, I take a relax. Mm -hmm. Every Rest day, but, yeah, yeah. Okay. but in the morning, 
I have to go uh, my cave, my house. Mm -hmm. and, and after I take a relax. After so I, I take a rest, you can say. I yeah. take a rest, okay. Uh, why are you studying oh, yeah. English? Let's discuss that question and then we talk about family, okay? So, Stephanie, you can start. Go ahead. Uh, make a question, but Okay. This dimension can be the message. No Spanish. <laughs> Spanish no more. Okay, okay Kelvin. I send the message. Okay. Kelvin, you're not on the WhatsApp group. Okay. Benjamin, Hi. it's always your responsibility <laughs> to send images to everyone. <laughs> you're lucky. Uh, so the first question okay. says, how right. how do members of a family support each other? What do you think, Michelle? In my family or what? In general, how do members of a family support each other? Well, I think maybe two. Or no. Well, um, but support in what? In what? Exactly, that's the question. What kind of support? Does your family give you and you give them and they give each other? Uh, well, maybe we, um, for example, in the house, we work together to do something that we want finally. Maybe we want to clean the, the house or the garden and mm -hmm. we, we do um, together. We do it together, good. Benjamin, uh, what are other ways of supporting I, the fa the members of the family? Um, in my case, for example, uh, my mom's cook for us. Um, my mom cooks I for work, us. I work for us too, <laughs> mm -hmm. and um, she, my mom, she she care of my children you can say my mom takes care or my mom or she takes care of my children she, only one subject okay mm -hmm. yeah she takes care of my children and and i take care of her <laughs> right okay very good so it's like everybody's taking care of each other and your family right Okay, Pedro and Kelvin, what do you think? And then you continue with the questions, all right? I'll be back. Okay, okay, okay. thank you. I, I work with my mom. She has a, a bookstore and I work with, with she. I work and with her. With her? Her, uh -huh. okay. And my father are living in USA and then parents my father yeah my father is living oh okay my father lives in the united states okay On, only that okay All right where do you guys live where do you live Lenin? i live in metapan metapan wow metapan. far away and you enrique i live in selvajoyo metapan in the Sel Guajo Sel Guajoyo Metapan. Sel Guajoyo. Interesting name. Never heard of it in my life. <laughs> Guajoyo. Where do you live, teacher? I live in Argentina in Buenos Aires. My God. Really? <laughs> yeah, that's uh -huh. even further away. But I am Salvadorian. My mom lives in Mexicanos near US. Okay. Uh-huh. So yeah. it's yeah. It's in the center of the, of the capital, I mean, the city, so yeah, it's good. 
Eh, Verónica. I live in Metapan too. What a coincidence! The three of you live in Metapan and you are in a group right now, yes. so that's, that's interesting. Bye. I, I think that we are the student of Funda Cesa. That's all of you. I think so. The 30 people. Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah. Ah, uh, that explains. So, Saira, you too. You live in Metapan too? Uh, no, I okay. live in, in Soyapango. Hmm, interesting. <laughs> so, uh -huh. do you know each other? Uh, Any of you? Uh, no? I know Enrique, I know Veronica because uh, they was my partners in the last uh, class. They, they were my, last my classmates. They were my classmates. classmates. Yeah. Okay. All right. Very good. So let's continue with the questions. I'll be back. Thank you, guys. Okay. Keep it on. Okay. For to try the the other people. For example, if you do something with low, the the something is the is better. For me, is the the most power in the family. Okay, in my case, it's possible. The most power in my family is the always respect in my family, very concerned all the time. For, for example, you need something, or I need to buy something, or I don't feel good, or I I had a, a bad day. My family always and is the it. My family for me, it's all for me because is the the family is is, is better in in, in all. It, and when I need something, always my family. Your family's there for you. Yes, it's okay, very great. great. The question you're discussing is who is the most powerful person in your family, right? I think. Yes. Uh huh. Okay. Who else? Who's next? Any anyone else? Another opinion? I don't know. In the mm -hmm. other, another person. In my case, it is it this. My family always stay in, in me and always give me low. And <laughs> I don't know, apoyar or and support me. Ah, support me. Okay. They will support and they give you support. Okay. Uh, what's the next question, Irania? No, I have the question, teacher. You're not in the WhatsApp group? No. And Carla, you're not in the WhatsApp group either. Can you check your email right now? Because on the email you will find the you will find the link to the group. Can teacher, can you put in the chat, please? Yeah, I have to go to my email and find it too. Hold on. Okay. Okay, so I guess read the next question. Somebody, let me see who. Richard, you have the questions? Uh, no, teacher. You don't have uh, them either? Really. <laughs> I have the question, teacher. Claudia, go ahead. Do you agree with saying children should be seen and not heard? Why do you agree or disagree? Aha, uh -huh, okay, let's discuss the question, guys. Um, uh, depend on the, the, the situation, maybe if two people are talking. Mm -hmm. You say, depending on the situation. Okay, depending of the situation. Mm -hmm. On. For it. No, for the, for um, for example, if two people are talking and sometimes uh, the children only can see and and they don't um, I don't know. This question is a is a little weird, maybe. Question is weird. Okay, what are your thoughts? I, I don't know that I... 
I don't sure that the meaning of this question. What number is it? What question is it, Claudia? For example, in the question say, should be seen and not hear. Maybe that means if, um, pueden ver and no oír, mm -mm. maybe. Mm -mm. Deberían no, ser vistos. So it means, it means pay attention guys. So, um, okay. Parents should only watch their children or they should also listen to their children. What is more important? Ah, okay. That is the question. What do you think, Carla? Uh, okay. About the question? Mm -hmm. um, I think so. My parents, um, in my home, uh, the parents will love the songs and um, say the love and respect. Um, I don't know. <laughs> no, more. Uh -huh. no, yeah, but the question is you shouldn't listen to your children. You should only watch them. Make sure that they are safe. Or you should also listen to what they need to tell you. Uh, that's the question. So, Irania, what do you think? I'm sorry, teacher. No, no, can't see the questions. You can't see them. Okay. No, yeah, but um, that's the question. Is it important to listen to children? That's the question. Is it important to listen to your children? Maybe Repeat, please. Is it important to listen to your children? No, understand. You understand? Okay. Uh, I'm asking the question here. Yes. For me, sorry, I understand the question right now. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, for me, I disagree with this question because yeah. the father ha how to put more attention in in their children. For example, when the children go to the school, maybe in the school uh, the children happen something, and they don't have the um, confianza. The trust. Uh, they don't have the trust to say the the parents to what happened them, mm -hmm. and the, the the fathers can can be more um, friendly with their children, and they have to put more attention. Yeah, they have to pay more attention. Very good. Good, 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 good answer. All right, Our teacher. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yes, I listen. I listen to children. My sons, for uh, they they are have the problems too. Uh huh. Right. They can help and you I, solve problems. Yes. I help you. <laughs> I help you always. You help them. Very good. All right. What is the next question? Um, Eduardo, you have the questions, right? Eduardo, next one. Okay. Are good family members or good friends more important? Why? And you, you, answer. you want the answer too? Me, can you write in the in the chat, please? Yeah, question? friends or family. What is more important? In my case, teacher, I think that. The both is more is important because both I had a, a friend. Important. Both, yes. Because I uh, I had a a friend is is a, a brother for me. Yeah. And and I I will come enjoying more moments than my my brother with yeah. my friends. <laughs> uh huh. Exactly. But it, it's more important both for me is more important both because. If you had a, a good family, you, you had a great friends too. Exactly. 
Good, good, good. What do you think, guys? The rest of you. Let me check on everyone else. Hold on, I'll be back. Continue. One more question and we'll finish. What problem do, do parents have to solve as their children grow up? I don't know, but the same question. What's more important, family or friends? Richard, what oh. do you think? Are uh, in USA and I don't have a relationship. Okay. You, Sarah? Okay. My family is very big. In my family, we are 21 brothers by all. <laughs> with my, <laughs> with my father, you. we are uh, six, 70, and only father and my mother are four. My father was a womanizer. It was a womanizer. <laughs> a womanizer. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, my father has 12 children, I think. That's right. <laughs> wow. That's a lot. 17 total, Sarah. See, si. for all are 21. 21 children. 21. <laughs> What on earth? That's a full they school. They, they didn't have full to school. eat. <laughs> to my brother. Uh, and he come, come to my house. He come at your house. house. Maybe. Oh, you know. Yes. Good. <laughs> we finished, teacher. All the questions, really? Teacher, I need to relax. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Hold on. Okay. The the so teacher is I, 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 I ask you because I didn't know. I'm yeah. here. What happened? Yeah, in this case, he is new in the class and uh, he don't understand about the the topic or what we are doing. Okay. Yes. No, we're just having a speaking practice right now, talking about family. Uh, okay. Yeah, we're gonna go back in a yeah. minute. But it, it's a lot of people, so I was checking everybody. You were the last group, so I can. I thought it. that. I thought that. I thought that. Uh, no problem. Yeah. Uh, I just, uh, I just ask you because I didn't know my first time. No, it's okay. Uh, is your camera working, Roberto? No, my English, my my internet, the internet is is not working good. Um, if I if I put the video. Uh, it doesn't work good. Mm, okay, I understand. All right, we're gonna go back right now. Okay. So let's go. Welcome back. Okay, so not everybody else is in the WhatsApp group, so you don't have access to the questions. Can somebody, I cannot find my email. Can somebody please send me the, the, um, the link, the invitation to join the WhatsApp group? Can somebody send it to me, please? Because I have like seven people who are not in the group yet. I think I sent it to you last night, didn't I? Oh, no. All right, please help me, guys. Somebody please send me the invitation, the WhatsApp invitation. Because I cannot find it. Anyway, uh, we're going to continue working with phrasal verbs. The last activity we did was uh, pick up the toys, I think, right? And all of those, I need the answers. So we're going to check. Tell me the answers for this. So the first one is pick up what? What was it? So there is an invitation, guys. If you are not in the WhatsApp group yet, check the chat right now and click on the invitation. All right. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Okay. What is number one? The, the, the noise. The noise. Kelvin. The trash. Uh, the toys. toys. The toys. Toys. Pick up the toys. All right. Number two. What is it? The life. The life. The life. Turn. The life. Um, the life. The lights. Off, please. So, if somebody is new and wasn't here <laughs> last night, we are working on the platform on section 1.4. Okay, that's what we're doing this exercise. <clears throat> okay, number three. 
the yard. Clean the yard up. So you say clean up. All right, four. Put what away? The trash. Mm, no. The book. That's like the saying, addiction. anda a guardar la basura. Can you imagine that? <laughs> <laughs> no, right? No, that's, what do you do with the trash? Outside. You take it the out. Book. You take it out. I don't know. What is something you can put away? Books. The books. books. Okay, let's the try with books. Them. Number five. The radio. The radio. The radio. The radio. 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 Let's try with the radio. radio. Turn down the radio. Yeah. The radio or the TV, radio. but teacher. Yes, I think we have more than one option. Yeah. Please <laughs> take off. What is the meaning of take off? Boot. Take off is the opposite of put on. I can say, hey guys, put your jacket on or take off your jacket. Your boots. Uh -huh. I don't have a hat. Do I have a hat? No. Anyway, it would be imagine I have a cap, right? And I'm like, put on the cap and take off the cap. So okay. both of them are opposites. Write them down because we're making a list, remember? So, and take off your boots. Yeah, it could be. Hang, hang up. Hang up means jacket. The jacket. Jacket. Okay, hang up means colgar, okay? I'm not gonna, but it's also for the phone. We also say colgar, right? In <coughs> Spanish for both mm -hmm. things, so it's the same, hang up. In, your Tisha, in this case, hang up is for clothes. Sí. Colgar. No, you can also use it for the phone. Ella, porque yo no vi nada. No he comido ni nada. Cari, Kenya, we hear you. We can hear you. Sorry. Sorry, 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 sorry. You're sorry. hungry. <laughs> no. All right. Please take out. Take out what? The trash. trash. The trash. The trash. The trash. Right. The trash. We're good. Let out. Who let the, the dogs dog. out? So the yeah, dog. The dog. definitely oh. the dogs. Do you know that song? Who let the dogs out? They are using that phrase up first. That phrase over. Let out. All right, and turn on the TV. The radio the or the TV or light. Uh huh. Yeah, you can turn on those three things. Let's see the TV. And I'm gonna check. Who let the dogs? What? The dogs. Who dogs. It's the dog. Ah, it's only one. one. The oh. pleader. All right. All answers are correct. Very good. Good job. So you finished this part, everybody? Miss, no. Um, can you can you show me the first list? One, two, three. Okay. All right. You have questions let about you, these phrasal verbs? Miss, mm -hmm. can you can you let the image right there? Yeah. Or <laughs> you're taking screenshots. And nine to ten. Books. Oh. All right, those are the right answers. Um, let's see, let's go to the next section. I don't know if we have exercises here. Otherwise, we're gonna practice speaking using, notice the stress, what have you? Let's see this. Right, get your microphones. Let's listen to a pronunciation of phrase of verbs. Pay attention, please. Hi again. Remember not only understanding grammar is important, but also pronunciation is as important. Please listen and practice the stress in two-part verbs. Pronunciation. 
Stress in two-part verbs. Part A. Listen and practice. Both words in a two-part verb receive equal stress. Pick up the toys. Turn off the light. Pick the toys up. Turn the light off. Pick them up. Turn it off. Now that you have listened to the stress, go ahead and practice saying the following two-part verbs. All right, let's repeat here. Stress in two-part verbs. I will play it. Part. You're going to listen and repeat, okay? A. Listen and practice. Both words in a two-part verb receive equal stress. Pick up the toy. Go ahead. Pick up the toy. Pick up the toys. Pick up the toys. Go ahead. Pick up the toys. Turn off the light. Turn off the light. Pick the toys up. Pick the toys up. Pick the toys up. You need to emphasize that. Up too. Turn the light off. Turn the light off. Turn the light off. Right. Turn the light off. Good. Pick them up. Pick them up. Pick them up. Pick them up. Go ahead. Turn it off. Turn it off. Turn it off. Turn it off. Now that you have listened to the stress, go ahead and practice saying the following two parts. Okay, let's read this. Um, how do you say the first one, Didi? Pick, <laughs> pick up all things. Pick up our things. You're going to mix it. I mean, pick you're going to link it. Pick, pick up, up our, our things. Pick up our things. Pick up our things. Very good. All right, next. <coughs> uh, Kelvin? Put it out. Yes, very good. Vladimir? Throw me off. Drop me off. Drop me off. Yes, that sounded better. Saul. Saul. Garcia. There you are. Sorry. Turn the radio up. Turn the radio up. Okay. Pedro Ramirez. Put the phone down. Phone down. Very good. Okay, now everybody repeat after me. Pick up our things. Pick up our things. Cut it out. Put it out. Drop me off. Drop me off. Turn the radio up. Put the phone down. Put the phone down. Very good. Okay. So, um, we're not going to go to the next section because we have to practice. So, I have some questions for you here. Yes, here. Take a screenshot. Is everybody on WhatsApp now? Okay, we sent the link, guys. I'm going to send it again. Please join WhatsApp right now so you can see the questions. Take a screenshot. Somebody take a screenshot of this and send the questions to the group, please. So, we are going to discuss the questions here. As you notice, we have phrase over. I want you to emphasize the phrase helpers. For example, Rodrigo Martinez, help me out. What time do you have to turn down the music volume? What? What the time to mm -hmm. what? what the time to have to turn down the music the music volume? Yes, what is the question? What is the answer? Sorry. Okay. So guys, in El Salvador, imagine you have a party, right? And it's Monday. What time do you have to turn down the music volume? Day. At 10 p.m., right? Or 10 p.m., right? And I don't remember. 11. 11 p.m. 10 p.m. 10 p.m. 
Wow. What about on on Saturday? So, uh, 3 a.m. 3 a.m. 2 p.m. No, 2 a.m. I think you mean. Mid -mid. 10 p.m. 2 a.m. 2 a.m. <laughs> I think it's 2 a.m. I don't know. So you have to say the phrase holders, right? In El Salvador, you have to turn down the music volume at 2 a.m. I need you to use the phrase helper, all right? So we're gonna see it in context. This is additional. Okay. Swimsuit. So let's discuss the questions, focus on using the phrase verbs. Do you have questions about the questions? Let me make this bigger. You understand all the questions? Uh, no, Miss. Uh, I don't understand what what we had to do with the with this question. We're gonna do a speaking practice using phrasal verbs. So you're gonna okay. answer the questions. That's it. Uh, but my question is, do you understand everything before you go and practice? Okay. I think you do, right? Do you know the meaning? So let's practice. I will make small groups this time. I will make groups of three. Let me see. Okay. So I will send you a new invitation, discuss the questions, and I will be with you in a minute. Rodrigo Martinez, are you there? Sorry? Let's practice. Uh, yeah. um, you have the question? Uh -huh. You have the question? I have to turn down the music at 10 p.m. But in the weekend, it's midnight when I have to turn down the music volume. volume. Okay. You, Dalia? Dalia? Um, in San Salvador, um, to turn down the music at the 10. Only, only four. Um, um, I like uh, the music, uh, the little, the little Okay, the second one, what are some things you always put on doing? To, no, put off doing. Mm -hmm. Sorry, excuse me, Irania. Yes? Do you have access to WhatsApp now? Uh, yes, I, 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 I have the, I les tomé una captura. <laughs> oh, okay, but did you join WhatsApp? Uh, I have a problem for my cell phone right now. Mm, okay. Yeah, make but, sure you join uh, WhatsApp uh, after class, please. Okay. Yeah, thank you. Continue, sorry guys. Thanks. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. Um maybe um go to run, go to walk, <laughs> mm -hmm. maybe beginning to do exercise, maybe tomorrow I I mm -hmm. I will start <laughs> to exercise. I understand mm -hmm. that Claudia, that's a picture you have, right? What? We don't see you. <laughs> really? No, now we see you. Okay. 
<laughs> oh, do you have access to the WhatsApp group? Ah, uh, it's a congelo. Claudia and Juanjo, you have access to WhatsApp, right? Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, very good. So yes, Claudia, I always put off doing exercise. I always say tomorrow, <laughs> next week. I will start the diet next week. And I never start the breakfast. <laughs> so for example, I, I maybe I can do exercise one or two times in a week, but start on a diet never. You never I happen. always say tomorrow, but that never never happens. You huh? always put it off. Try to use the phrase of work, okay? Let's focus yeah. on that. Very good. Continue. Good job. Uh, okay. Oh, Carla, you have access to WhatsApp now? Yes. <laughs> okay, awesome. Very good. Clara, I think Clara cannot participate, right? No. Yeah, I think no. she's sick, so she won't. All right, what question are you discussing? Se los acabo de pasar a Carla porque no las tenía. Pero sí que me aparece. Ya pudo entrar al grupo de WhatsApp. Sí. Ah, ahorita sí. Ajá. Ahorita me caí. Ok. Se unió. Ah, sí. Ok, la vuelvo a enviar ahí. Ya está. Ok. So, first question or... What time do you have to turn, uh, turn down the music, the music volume? Mm -hmm. I have to turn down the music volume to... 10 p.m. At? At 10 p.m. 10 p.m. during weekdays. What about during the weekend? In the weekend, I tore, I have to turn down the music at 2 a.m. Mm -hmm. Yep, very good. Okay. Ah, no. I'm sorry, Lenny. No, no, no. Continue. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> Go ahead. Go ahead. And um, did you call someone back today? Mm -hmm. Someone? No, I didn't. No, I didn't. My friend and my mother called me, so I called them back because I missed them. Yeah. What about you, Lenny? Yes, I did. I called my I called my sister. Back. I use the phrase word, called back, called back, and call called back. Call back. back. Okay. Very good. Okay. All right, continue. Good job. Okay. <laughs> How long do you watch TV before you turn if it? For me, pieces of clothing uh, in winter, a jacket. Uh, I don't know. What do you say? Bufanda in English, teacher. Can you help me? Scarf. Sucks. Sucks very hot. Hard. I, I wear and I wear a t-shirt, uh, pants, jacket, and boat. Boots or boat? boots? <laughs> maybe, boots. Maybe. Boats are robots. No, hold on. But uh, what, is the, what is the phrase holder? I don't see the phrase holder. Put on. Ah, put on. Okay, winter. let's try to use it. In winter, I put on a scarf, a jacket. Okay, try to use the phrase. Oh, that's jacket. the most important thing. Okay. Okay. Use the word. Uh -huh. Yes, that's use it. Use the word put on. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. But it's called wear? Yeah, you can say wear. To wear. To wear. Wear. Yeah, wear. it is correct. But we are trying to use the phrase over, so yeah. Put on. Okay. Put on. Mm -hmm. In my case, put on in winter. No, I jacket. put on. Put on, I put jacket. on. It's a verb. I put I. on. Mm -hmm. I put on jacket, uh, tennis, uh, pants, and only that. <laughs> All right. In winter, guys, where do you live? Uh, uh, outerwear. Outerwear. Excuse me. Where do you guys live? I live in Metapan. A lot of people in this group are from Metapan. Of course. Metapan is very hot. It's very hot. 
Can you say? I put on, I put on jacket, put and pan when I visit Monte Cristo. Mm -hmm. yes. Have you been? Have you been in Metapan, teacher? Maybe. Maybe, but I don't remember. Maybe. <laughs> okay, what are some famous places okay. in Metapan? Uh, Lago de Guija, Apuzunga, eh, Monte Cristo, Azacualpa. No, I have never been in Metapan then. No. It's Everyone close to Guatemala. Yeah. You Maybe. need to pass Metapan to, to go Esquipulas. It's a famous place of Guatemala. Yeah, maybe I have definitely passed by, but not visited any place. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but a lot it's of a good classmates city. live in Metapan. Metapan have a very important church. Churches has very important churches. Church. Colonial. Mm -hmm. Colonial. Mm -hmm. All right, continue, guys. I'll be back. Okay, in summer, I put on short t-shirt, a cap, bed, and I and I start to watch TikToks, and later <laughs> I put away my phone. Put away, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's funny. That's um. happening. <laughs> You, Veronica? Yes, in my case, I put away, put away my cell phone. Um, maybe I first I watch the video in YouTube, or I don't know the videos, and after I put away my cell phone in a share. <laughs> Okay, okay. Yeah, cell phones don't let us sleep, right? It's hard to sleep after seeing this phone. Okay, the next one. Is it a custom in your country to take off your shoes before entering a house? No. No. <laughs> no. Nope. Japan, I maybe. Yeah, or, or Korea. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. But I Japan. take off. I take off my Japan, Calvario. Okay. Um, number four. What time you? Do, what time do? Um. I forget, but is put away. Teacher. Put away is guardar. Oh. oh, okay. Y put back es ponerlo de regreso. Sí, es que tenía la confusión entre esas dos. Okay, okay so how do you answer the question? Use the phrase helper so that you can memorize it. Everybody use it, okay? Okay. okay. Eh, eh. No. Yeah. <laughs> Today I don't call no one. I don't call. I didn't call anybody back. Um, I didn't call only, back anybody. Uh, only text chat. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Didn't call anybody back. Use the price over. All right, let's go back. Hmm. Okay, here we are. Did you guys practice? A lot? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yeah. You see, everything you learn, you need to practice speaking so you can use it, all right? That's very important and that's my focus, at least personally. I need you to really use it. So now, are the phrasal verbs clear? What is uh, put away, guys, in Spanish? No, let's put on. Put away. Put away. Okay, let's put away in Spanish. Is put, put 
something in your in your place original. Original place. Mm. Es poner no, las cosas donde se back. guardan. Ajá, put away es guardar. Uh -huh. Okay. Yo le estaba diciendo todo el significado. No, that's okay. I appreciate that. Pero es que aún así no quedó claro. Bueno, ok. Put away, <risa> guardar. Y put off, postpone. Posponer. Posponer. Ok, put back es... Volver. Volver al sitio original. O sea, ponerlo de regreso. All right. A donde estaba. A donde estaba, exactly. So put it back where it was. Exactly. So that's the meaning. Now that you practice, Volver is for it. No, no, no. Volver is go back. 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 Still yeah. this work? Yeah. All right, let's do this. I need everybody after class. Oh, we have to take a picture. You saw the message, right? For the attendance. So it's not for fun anymore. Hoy va a ser por obligación la foto. Ni la mandé anoche. Ya me acordé. Sorry, la perdí. Okay, I will take a picture right now. So everybody. Smile. Eduardo. <laughs> Eduardo is covering his face. Like, don't look at me. All right, everybody smile. One, two, three. Thank you, guys. Okay. Um, I will see you again tomorrow. Oh, after class, please send one example using one phrasal verb. The most difficult phrasal verb for you. Not the easiest one. Send one sentence right now after class, okay? Please. Is that cool? Yep. Hold on. Pero ven, alguien no me sale en la foto. Clara, creo. Okay. Teacher, le puedo preguntar en, en privado una cosa que tengo duda ahí. Ya, yeah, pero termino okay. acá en dos horas, así que quizá mañana al rato. Uh -huh. Pero pregúntame. Sí. Let me see. Mm -mm -mm. Hold on, I need another picture, guys. Hold on. Ah, this is number two. Bueno, esta no quedó bonita. So, send, send a sentence with the most difficult phrase Albert for you. All right. See you tomorrow, guys. Have a beautiful night. Tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night. Thank you. Good night. Bye. 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 Thank you.